there is an, uh, two articles on that. But, you know, um, I, I just want to mention that when I went to take that examination uh, in Hassan, the first time I came back I, crying because the exam was in um, English and I had studied in a Canada medium school. So I came back and told the headmaster that I failed the exam because it was in English. And he wrote a letter sitting in Gorur, that village, to the defense ministry saying that, how can you give exams in a foreign language or English to people in the villages because English is not intelligence. You know, you, you, you can have English, but that's not intelligence. So if you want people from villages to join, then you should give the exam in their language, native language. So I'm very proud sometimes when I come here, when compared to Bangalore, for example, where uh, people s speak more in English than in, like we are doing here now, than in their own mother tongue. And like here, where I see many people, uh, most people speaking in Malayalam, even though they know English, like in France, and uh, which is an extraordinary thing. So I then, uh, Somebody saw that a postcard that he sent from my village in Delhi. Because the exam was given by the defense ministry. And uh, they, then after three months, he came and said, look, they're giving one more exam in Canada because they saw my letter. They said, thank you for pointing out. So I went again and I passed. So uh, that was my first lesson that you do not uh, take no for an answer.